Hey YouTube, welcome back to my channel. If you're a regular subscriber, you're probably not. I don't have that many friends on YouTube. But we're here today to do a comparison, um, mainly just a review between the Neon Volt pre-workout and uh, White Flood by Controlled Labs. Now, I did a pretty extensive uh, review on the Neon Volt, and as you can see, I have finished it off. It's gone. Um, excellent taste all the way through. Definitely would recommend it if you're a taste person that goes on taste alone for pre-workout. Honestly, you, you shouldn't. Um, you really should go with what's in this. Uh, that'll give you that pump and that energy. Now, it had a, an energy blend in it that was only 206 milligrams, which means the caffeine was really low, the energy blend was really low. And honestly, you know, for a first-time pre-workout user, this worked. Uh, this is the first time I was taking actual pre-workout when I started with this, uh, God, four months ago. And it worked. It, it was perfectly fine for the average um, beginner pre-workout user. Uh, I quickly, within probably, uh, gosh, a month or two, got pretty used to it. Um, just pretty much didn't really do a ton. It gave me a little bit of focus, gave me a little bit of drive to go to the gym, but didn't really give me that pump didn't really give me that, you know, super focus and that that drive to go the extra rep. Um, I mean, I recommend it. I still do recommend it. The flavor is fantastic. It tastes like a, a melted Jolly Rancher. And if flavor is something for you and you're a beginner to pre-workouts, this is good. It's also pretty good value. I picked it up at GNC um, for, gosh, I can't remember, like $36, $37. And it's got 36 servings in it. I only use a half a scoop because I work out at night. Right now it's 10 after 9. Just got back from the gym. I want to do this quick review. Do recommend if you're a first time user. Uh, I mean, it's just got your typical stuff in it your beta alanine, your L uh, citrulline. Just, it's, honestly, it's just your basic stuff that any pre workout has. This one is creatine, uh, creatine free, but it does have caffeine for your stimulant. Let's move on to the new, what I got, White Flood from Controlled Labs. Now, I'm not being paid by any of these companies. I'm just going to throw that out there. But I do want to tell you that allstarhealth.com has these tubs of White Flood, which have 20 servings per container for 8 bucks plus shipping. So I got two of these shipped for $20. Fantastic deal. Couldn't beat it. Wanted to try White Flood. Heard it was a great, great pre-workout. Creatine-free. Uh, again, I'm in my cut right now, so creatine-free is is beneficial for me. I don't want to carry water weight, even though I know it's only my muscles. Still don't want to carry the weight. I wanted stimulant-free. I was going to make my own pre-workout, but I can't make it for the cost that this is. So I was like, whatever. I work out at night. I'll just continue to take a half a scoop. It doesn't mess. You know, I've had this for a couple weeks now. It doesn't mess with my sleep cycle. Um, doesn't mess with, you know, getting up in the morning. It, it's, it's perfectly fine. Um, I find it has almost the exact same ingredients um, as a neon, just in a completely different just in a completely different, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Concentration. So here we have uh, an NO complex, a flood, an, a flood NO complex of 1,500 milligrams compared to, you know, the, what, 250 milligrams or whatever it was in this? The 206 milligrams. So 1,500 of it is an NO complex, and then there's an endurance complex of 1,200 milligrams, and that's beta alanine and L tyrosine. And that's fantastic. I'm, I'm a fan of that. It's 1,200 milligrams. And then there's a, a live energy complex. And it's pretty much, it, it's got a little more um, natural uh, su substances than this for your, for your um, energy. But it's got 2,100 milligrams as compared to 206. So as you can see, this has a lot more of that energy blend. It's got a lot more of uh, your NO pump. Um, one of the, if you read reviews or look at reviews on this, one of the problems people say they have with this is it doesn't give you enough pump um, in your muscles, and honestly, it, I mean, it gives you 10 times better pump than the Neon Sport, but I've been taking, when I was in my bulk, I was taking NO boosters, 
um, strictly made for NO, boosting NO, and that gave you ridiculous pump. So I still think this doesn't have a ton of pump, but it has more pump than that Neon Volt. There's no doubt about that. Now, this White Flood, I got it because it was creatine-free, had a good energy blend, and had low side effects. Also came in my favorite flavor of watermelon. Um, let's compare flavors between this White Flood and the Neon Sport. The Neon Sport tastes like a melted Jolly Rancher. This tastes, this tastes like a chemically induced watermelon. It tastes like this watermelon was made in a lab and was kind of like a bad watermelon that they just kind of ground up into a powder. Um, it's very chemically tasting, it's very plasticky tasting, but it still has that watermelon taste. Um, it smells terrible. I'm not gonna lie. This, when you smell it, when you smell it here, it smells absolutely freaking horrible because it has all that root in it, that, uh, that energy complex, and that's all natural plant roots, and that kind of smells like crap. As you can see, here's the scooper. It's kind of low and fat. Uh, it works well for what you need to do, which is scoop freaking powder. Uh, I still only take half a scoop at night when I work out, but let's talk about what happens on that half a scoop. So this one has directions, which is fantastic because this doesn't have any freaking directions. It just says, be careful, don't take more than two scoops in 24 hours. No shit, it's pre-workout. This one at least tells you take, you know, half a scoop to two scoops, depending on your tolerance, uh, 30 minutes before your workout. Great, that's what I do. 30 minutes before I work out, dump half a scoop in 10 ounces of water, chug it down, wait 30 minutes, go to the gym. Now, these past few days, I've been having a really tough time getting to the gym because it's freaking two degrees out, it's cold, it's blowing snow, the roads are covered, and I hate New York. And so, once I take this, I actually start feeling better about going to the gym. I'm getting, I get that energy. I'm getting that focus. I get ramped up. I get into that gym mindset where I'm like, yeah, let's go to the gym and do this. And I end up going to the gym. And I always take a full water bottle to the gym with me. That's a given. But this stuff makes me drink water like mad. We'll get to that in a second. So this gives me that focus, that drive to go to the gym. It's been giving me that drive to go to the gym for a couple weeks now. When I get to the gym, I'm pumping harder. I'm pumping faster. I'm doing quicker sets. I'm doing more sets. I'm doing heavier sets um, than I've done on any other pre-workout. And I'm often finding that the gym isn't open long enough for me to be there. I go at 7.30 at night. My gym closes at 9. And I get out about 5 to 9 every night. And um, I wish it was open longer. I'd be there longer. I'd be working away. This is giving me incredible energy to do that. Uh, as far as side effects, and I, I mean, I want to keep this under 10 minutes because I don't want to bore you guys. So as far as uh, side effects for this, besides the great focus, the lift strength, um, a little bit of the pump. It's, I mean, it's there, but it's not as good as I'd like to see it. Uh, negative side effects of this, which are really weird makes me yawn I yawn all the time at the gym now like between sets you know between uh, reps I'm, I'm yawning and it's like the hell I look bored at the gym but I'm not it's just this shit makes me yawn and I haven't yawned on anything else but this um, it makes me extremely thirsty and I'm not talking okay drink some water and it's gone thirsty I'm talking my lips get dry my tongue gets dry thirsty I have to drink a crap ton of water with this stuff. I drink almost 32 ounces of water when I'm at the gym for an hour and a half uh, on this stuff. And I used to take down maybe 18 or 20. Now I'm at a full bottle of 32. Really thirsty. And then I have to get that water out. It makes me pee. I have to pee in the middle of my freaking routine, which sucks. I've never had to do that before uh, I started taking this. Started taking this. Have to pee about 10 sets into my you know, 25, 30 set routine, that sucks, but it's all right. This is giving me great focus, great energy, controlled labs, white flood, go pick it up, try it. It's relatively cheap, creatine free, tons of stimulants, but I really do enjoy this pre-workout. So if you guys want a good pre-workout that'll get you through your workout and get you motivated to go to the gym, make you pump harder, longer, heavier, Controlled Labs White Flood. Can't say enough about it. Have a good one, guys. Until next time, I'm out.